Hi everybody, so tonight in class we're actually going over Naihachi. We were actually doing Naihachi Shodan, Nidan, and Sandan. And they were actually looking at some of the moves that are within the kata itself. So I got one of my students, John, uh, he's going to be working with me tonight, uh, showing and demonstrating what we did in class. So we're actually working on the covering move of Naihachi Shodan as it goes to here, the elbow fold, and then going into your next moves down and then back across. So we're actually going to focus on this here to cover. So as John gets ready to punch, he's actually going to punch. I'm going to cover the hand coming out as I come through. I could be using to strike anywhere into the neck, facial area coming through. So one, and as it drops down, I'm going to cradle the forearm here inside of his arm for this movement. So the hand is open. And as I come through, this is going to actually lock behind his elbow as I come through and then I would continue on into the downward strike. So it's here and then go straight into it with that. So as I grapple and then drop coming from here, it's, it can really damage a person's arm. So if you're gonna practice this, be very careful with it. Another idea we're actually looking at is as it comes through is as I strike is to actually hit this, strike the arm as I bring the elbow through at the same time, strike, boom, clip it, and then go into it, which is gonna severely damage that elbow joint. So we wouldn't recommend doing that in your training, but just understand that it is still there, another option for you. But as we're going through one more time here, cover, there's my strike coming in. It's also here, if he throws his punch, now my hand is here, I can actually come back across and go to this direction in the kata. So there's always that option to weave. So again, one, Two, I could strike him here coming through, or like we were doing in class tonight, one side striking here. This is always here to cover my face coming in. There's the grapple, and then we would actually set it up into the next move, which would actually be going through with the kata coming through. So there's a couple things we were doing tonight. Again, uh, thanks to my student, John, for stepping in, buddy. Appreciate it. And then uh, try it out. Let me know what you think. Be careful and working with your partners. Make sure you take care of your training partners, and we'll see you on the next one.